Oh hey guys! So I just started a new game of Blush Blush. Um, first time I've played it, so thought I'd read you the cutscene. It's the first day of summer, and the city's new zoo is celebrating its grand opening. You got kind of got some haunted music though. <laughs> As a zoo senior rehydration engineer, it's your job to hand out bottles of completely normal, very non-magical water. But something goes terribly wrong. Oh gosh. Momentarily, distracted by all the super hot guys, you accidentally hand out the zoo's entire supply of magically cursed water. Oh no, look, they're becoming furries. Dude. These are bunny and a wolf. No, how could this happen? <laughs> Suddenly, there are flashes of light and puffs of smoke. All around, there are sounds of attractive men being transformed into animals. Over humanity. Or the animanity, I guess. Each of newly transformed uh, manimals races off in a flurry of chaos, leaving only a single solitary bunny behind. Oh no, not a bunny. <laughs> okay. Um, beg your pardon, the bunny says. I appear to have been transformed into a hare of some kind. I could get a refund on my admission, if it's not too much trouble. <laughs> his little nose twitches a bit, and as you stare into his beautiful brown eyes, you are filled with a sudden powerful determination <laughs> to get him that refund. And also to find a way to break the curse. But how were you to accomplish such a thing? As though on cue, you suddenly hear a voice from the heavens. Oh, hi. oh my. Hi, <laughs> you there, says the magical spirit animal in the sky. Look at you, stuck in the middle of this weird anime plotline. <laughs> um, good for you. My name's Kyube. My name's Kyube. And, and I'm going to help you out. Because only an act of true love is going to break those curses. And you look like you could use a crash course. Is this so cringe? Yeah. <laughs> Put on your dancing shoes. Take your breath and follow me. I'm not doing a voice, guys. It's time to play some Blush Blush. Let's get started. All right, let's get started. Just tap on the guy's tab and then Neem's cute little face. Neem? I'm gonna call him Neem. To see how he's doing. Oh no. The tutorial. Nim! Oh, that's his name. Nim, as in. Remember. Okay, each guy you unlock will have different desires you need to fulfill in order to grow their love for you. Remember, only love can break the curse. Hmm. Looks like Nim just wants a refund for his zoo admission. Sounds reasonable. For that, you're going to need a job. Tack on the job tabs. Oh. Most of them are locked right now, but I guess you're not qualified yet. Uh -huh. Each job takes time blocks to do, and you only have a few to spare. Don't worry, once you turn them off, you get your time blocks back. Alrighty. Tap on the Saw Pro job to start your exciting career. Woo! Ha! <laughs> so handing out bottles of water was not really that exciting. Great! Woo! I'll be able to afford a refund <laughs> sometime. And here's one more hot tip for jobs. If you keep a job active for long enough, you'll earn promotions. Which means more money in your pocket. Being employed rules. Ah, uh, yeah, I, I know. It would if I were. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's go back to Nim. Okay. Okay, now we've got money flowing in. I'll teach you about hearts. It's super easy. Every relationship level you reach will need hearts, and they're super easy to earn. You can get hearts by chatting, giving gifts, dating, or even just by tapping on the guy a whole bunch. Okay. <laughs> Right, chat with Nim with the talk button and then give him a bunch of tappy taps. Oh my god. But so you've been turned into a rabbit. What's new? Yes, new is definitely the word for it. 
Okay, so the last game like this was kind of based on anime, and I played it a bit, that's because I was kind of bored, I suppose. But uh, yeah, this one kind of seems to be more furry themed, I guess. Let's get him some hearts, man. They're even going up. Oh, I have to talk to him, actually. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. Well, may as well look on the bright side. I can scratch my face with my foot now. Wait. You mean you couldn't scratch your face with your foot before? Is that just me? Gosh, I can scratch my face with my foot. Gee, I'm quite flexible though. <laughs> Which is not high on my list of priorities. But was probably in there somewhere. Uh... Okay. <laughs> well, I'm not sure this is working. I understand if you'd rather shake hands or part ways now. You mean paws? I don't, you don't have hands anymore. Uh, it seems like a lot of trouble. Oh, oh you keep trying. Great, thanks for sticking with it. I'm one appreciative bunny. Yes, of course. Okay. Whee! We'll go to the next stage. Okay, for his next level, Nim is hoping uh, for you to level up your smart stat and take him to dinner. Or we could have him for dinner. <laughs> I don't know. Rabbit's kind of popular in France and stuff. <laughs> it's time to learn about hobbies. Uh, I'm going to talk to him again. Um. <laughs> the little sounds are kind of cute. Okay. I had a dream last night that I turned back into a human, but then I got ready for the day and went to work before I woke up. So that's about 3 out of 10. Would not recommend. <laughs> oh, we go to the hobby stab. Okay, each hobby you work will um, work on improves one of your stats. They'll each take three time blocks to do, so once again, you'll need to use your time wisely. Yay. Fortunately, you've got enough to do some reading, which will make you smart. Activate your reading hobby. Huh. Whilst you're working on that, make sure you have some free time blocks and we'll take Nim on a date. You can tell how many time blocks you have and how many are in use at the top of your screen here. Yeah. <laughs> So green means jobs, orange, hobbies, pink, dates, got it. Let's read. Now, I hate to say this, guys, but I actually think reading probably does make you smart. So maybe it's for the reverse. Maybe smart people read more. That's not to say that reading is necessary or awesome or anything like that. I think... Um, for example, guys like to watch a lot of YouTube videos. Women like to read more, statistically. Um, obviously, there are lots of people who buck the trends, but um, I don't know. Some of the smartest people I know have read a lot, a lot, a lot of books, so there's definitely some kind of correlation there. Um, okay, let's have a look at Nim. Uh, he's just saying about his dream again. Uh, um... <laughs> I just stepped on my ear, which is a really funny sentence. Should we go for a date, man? Oh, have to do dinner, shall we? Uh, three time blocks. Okay. Mm. Now let's go for a date. Mm. Ah, oh, there we go. <laughs> I love it. He's just eating his carrot, man. <laughs> yeah, no symbolism there or anything. Go again? Yeah, why not? Uh, uh. This is quite a strange game, actually. Especially with the music. Maybe they put the music in for Halloween. I don't know. Level 1 Guts. So... Basically, it kind of seems like we acquire more people as the game goes through. We look at um, stats, age 20, birthday, blood type. Oh, I don't know if you guys know, but in Japan, blood type really matters, for example. Um, for some reason, I think different blood types have different personalities. And actually, from what I read, there seems to be a little bit of evidence that this could actually be correct to some extent. 
though I don't know it's kind of like astrology but maybe there is something in it who knows so kind of the chef de parte uh, me a fancy carrot Oh, so prepare me a fancy carrot. Sorry, I should really read instead of... Uh, and the waiter to try to scratch out the word... Uh, Hasperefa from my menu. Oh, I see that's rabbit. <laughs> that sounds like a French word, yeah. Go on another date. Let's go on a boat ride, guys. So we're going to need four time to go on the boat ride. So I stop this for now. <clears throat> go on a date, boat ride. Yay! We're on a boat ride, dude. So I kind of get the feeling that some of these graphics were um, kind of recycled from other places. Like, uh, you can kind of see this as like a photo. Maybe like a generic RPG photo or something, and they've drawn the rabbit and the um, duck down here, which is quite sweet. Uh, okay. Um. Hmm. Um. Well, I'm glad that much at least. I've never been on a quest, but I have a seeking suspicion I would be particularly good at them. I wouldn't be particularly. Jeez, from sorry guys. While walking through the park, you catch Nymph giggling himself. Sorry, I was just thinking how much easier it is making friends as a rabbit and caught myself wondering why I hadn't tried this sooner. <laughs> hmm? Wait, so it seems like we're on level two now. So we've sort of earned the photo. I dug up my own garden yesterday <laughs> and built a den. A warren? Whatever rabbit should build. I might get desperate and set a trap for myself. Oh, that's how you do it! So you can kind of uh, click on a little rabbit here and it'll give you more hearts. Uh, um... I shouldn't do this, guys, but what I'm going to do, I'm going to load up an auto clicker. And. Because I can't be bothered to click. So. Um, oops. Let's go back to the game. If I press F6... Oh look, the auto-click is doing it for me. This is just your bog-standard auto-clicker I just downloaded off the internet, guys. It's so useful for everything. Also, it kind of says that we're um, frenemies at the moment. I'm going to go back to hobbies and go for survival. Hmm? So if I go back to stats, um, favourite food is oatmeal cookies, good to know. Favourite job is baker, um, gift preference ice cream, and he likes to trait smart, interesting. So I'm going to go back to smart. Oh look, I can do both of these in the hobbies tab. No, I don't want to buy the thing. Oh, guys, it looks like I've just got another time slot, which is interesting. <gasps> oh my gosh. I might end the video here soon, but you kind of get an idea of what the game is like. But we've just unlocked another furry creature. <gasps> One day, whilst out in the forest practicing your survival training, you're attacked out of nowhere by a sharply dressed bear. Well, more or less. <laughs> But before she can land a super sick burn, a wolf suddenly intervenes. That's the wolf, I guess. After a ferocious battle, the wolf drives the bear away and looks at you with intense, brooding eyes. As he licks his wounds, he scoffs. Oh, it's you. Well, don't get too excited. That bear and I just had a, some uh, unfinished business. Why are you looking at me like that? What's with the weird gleam in your eye? Don't tell me you're gonna... to keep bothering me. <laughs> hey. hey, I kinda got his voice right. So, I'm a wolf. 
all my boyhood dreams have come true. So bad, um, <laughs> too bad I was such a damn ass kid. Talk to me again. <laughs> yeah, I keep looking over at the elderly yoga classes in the park. We really got to fix this before um, I go all animal planet on those guys. That's cool. So yeah, you kind of go through guys and you um, obviously build up your skills and um, get a whole bunch of stuff as you go through the game. No, oh, go away. Oh, I see. I can go back to the tab here. Oh, damn. So it kind of looks like to do unlock the um, guys right at the bottom, you kind of need to go to the store and um, kind of purchase stuff. But I suppose that's kind of, well, it kind of makes sense, I guess. There's still a heck of a lot of levels here um, to go through, all the dialogue and whatnot. Um, so yeah, as you guys build up your skills, you kind of unlock different um, jobs and stuff. So, for example, uh, if I want to unlock Baker, I need 5 Spartan, 5 Healthy. So if we go back to Hobbies, uh, or Stats. Uh, sorry, I'll go back to Hobbies. I'm currently level 4 reading, so... When I'm level 5 reading and level 5 survival, um, which will give me guts, it will sort of unlock different jobs. Actually, guys, look at this. To be a musician, which will earn me significantly more money, I need free guts. So all I'd have to do is stop... is to... stop a job for a sec and go for um, Survival Sue to get to level 3. So yeah, it's kind of a game where you keep progressing and you keep making money and that's kind of it so let me know what you guys think uh, i will speak to you guys soon and if you like the content please let me know and have an awesome day guys